Meet the most important new car of 2011. This is Ford's new Focus. And the third generation of Ford's best-selling family car is all new. That means it gets an all new platform, an all new body, all new interior, and a host of gizmos inside. The highlight under the bonnet is a 1.6 litre turbocharged EcoBoost engine. Now it's also a world car, and that means for the first time, if you buy this car in Los Angeles or London, you're pretty much getting the same thing. That's good for Ford because it means it saves them money. But is it good for you? There's only one way to find out. First impressions are mixed. In recent years, Ford has become synonymous with strong design. But the latest focus isn't particularly daring. In fact, those triangular shaped details in the front bumper make it look a little awkward. But on the move, the 180 brake horsepower, 1.6 litre turbocharged engine is fantastic. Super smooth, linear in its delivery, and hugely flexible. It's happy to pull hard from low revs, sit quietly on the motorway, or race to the 6,000 RPM rev line, showing no let up in punch. Okay, so on the move and the new Focus, and the first thing that strikes you is, is just the quality of the cabin, really. It's a really premium place to be. Um, it's come from the C-Max, which means you get this great piano black centre console. Now, there may be a few too many buttons on there, but um, it certainly looks great, and the fit and the finish is fantastic. Other nice touches, well, um, on the door handle, as you open the door, there's an LED strip which glows red and then goes to pink, and it's, a, it's just a really high quality thing, it looks lovely. Above your head, there are some neat lights, also by LED, and you can kind of um, adjust the dimming of those for map reading and things like that. And the whole thing really adds up to just a, a really sort of high spec interior that just, um, it hasn't really been seen in this class before. It just feels really good. But is a new Focus as good to drive as it's always been? Well, there's no doubt that it is. And that's thanks mainly to uh, the power steering system. This is a new electric setup, which is more efficient, but it's also smoother, um, and uh, but still tells you all you need to know about the road surface. The handling is brilliant. Um, it's obvious that this new Focus is a much more grown up and mature car. The ride is very smooth, it's very quiet, and comfortable as well but it's still a lot of fun when you get into corners. Um, and that's down to some torque vectoring system, which just means that the, the power of the engine is put straight to the road surface. It's very smooth, works very well with the ESP system, so much so that you don't even notice it doing its job. And combine that with the electric power steering system, which is also very smooth, with no kickback at all, but plenty of feel. And you've got a car that manages to be fun, when you want it to be, but then quiet and smooth and refined when you just want to cruise and, uh, and relax. So what's the verdict? Has Ford pulled off another winner? Well, while we're not so sold on the looks, everything else ticks the boxes. The 1.6 litre engine is an absolute peach, the chassis is a dream, and the interior is a real step above in terms of quality. In fact, you have to say, as an overall package, there's no doubt that Ford, again, has pulled it off.